Imagine you're standing in an open field. The cool morning air brushes against your face. Suddenly, a blinding light shatters the silence and the earth beneath you starts to quiver. You turn around and see a mushroom cloud conquering the sky. Monstrous, immense, terrifying. To your left, the echo of Hiroshima. To your right, the shadows of Sarbamba. You stand right in the middle, between the extreme poles of human power and destruction. Today, we take you on a journey through the most ferocious nuclear bombs the world has ever known. In this episode of How to Stay Alive, the most ferocious atomic bombs in the world. Step one, the dark hour of Hiroshima. It's the 6th of August, 1945, a day that will forever change the world. Hiroshima, a thriving Japanese city, awakens to a seemingly normal morning, oblivious to the fate looming in the blue sky above. At precisely 8.15, the clear sky transforms into an inferno of light and fire. The first atomic bomb ever dropped in warfare named Little Boy detonates with a force of about 15,000 tons of TNT. In this moment, the city is catapulted into a nightmare. Buildings crumble to dust, people are reduced to shadows, and a searing heat akin to the core of the sun engulfs everything in its path. Hiroshima, home to over 340,000 people, becomes the epicenter of humanity's darkest hour. Step two, North Korea's shockwave. 2017, the 3rd of September, 2017. A date that resonates like a thunderclap in the annals of recent history. Deep beneath North Korea's earth in the labyrinthine tunnels of the Pungye ri test site, the world bears witness to an event that rattles the international order. On this day, North Korea detonates its most powerful nuclear bomb to date. The earth quakes as if struck at its very heart. The tremor is so strong that it is registered worldwide. With an estimated yield of 250,000 tons of TNT, this explosion far surpasses the destructive potential of Hiroshima. In this moment, as the shockwave radiates beyond North Korea's borders, it becomes clear the world stands at a new and perilous crossroads. The shadow of a potential nuclear conflict once again darkens the horizon of our time. Step 3, B-83, The Unstoppable. In the depths of a secured secret storage site in the United States lies a weapon of nearly mythical power, the B-83, the most potent nuclear bomb in the United States arsenal. With an unfathomable yield of up to one and a half million tons of TNT, it is a behemoth designed to reduce entire cities to ash. This bomb, sleeker and more modern than its predecessors, is a silent but unstoppable sentinel of nuclear balance. In an era where the Cold War is long past, the B-83 remains a stark testament to the terrifying extent of human ingenuity when it comes to bringing death and destruction. It is not just a bomb, it is a symbol of an era when humanity gained the power to annihilate its own planet multiple times over. You're probably wondering, how could I prepare for such a challenge? Or what equipment would I need to survive such extreme conditions? We have something for you that might be of interest. Check out the video description and discover the product that could make a difference in this particular episode. Trust us, you'll want to know. But now, let's get back to the video. Step 4. Operation Castle Bravo, The Awakening of the Giant. It is the 1st of March, 1954, at Bikini Atoll in the Pacific Ocean a place whose name will forever be synonymous with nuclear catastrophe. The clock is ticking, the tension is electrifying as the United States prepares the ignition for a test that would go down in history. Operation Castle Bravo. What was planned as a routine test quickly morphs into a nightmare. The bomb, with a yield of 15 megatons of TNT, which is 5,000 times Hiroshima, unleashes a force that even its creators had underestimated. The explosion is so massive that it generates a fireball that vaporizes everything within several kilometers. The ash cloud rises, the earth trembles, and in this moment, the giant awakens. The world looks on in horror at this terrifying display of the power that humanity now holds in its hands, a power capable of shaking the earth itself. Step 5. Tsar Bomba 50, the Queen of Bombs. Imagine an explosion that can be perceived even from space, a colossal mushroom cloud tearing 23 kilometers up into the sky seeming to swallow the sunlight itself. It is the 30th of October, 1961, and the Soviet Union has just detonated the Tsar Bomba, the Queen of Bombs. With a yield of 50 megatons of TNT, it is the largest man-made explosion of all time. It was so immense that it shattered windows over 900 kilometers away, and even sent seismographs on the other side of the world into a frenzy. In this moment, the monstrous extent of human destructive power becomes unmistakably clear. 
a potent and terrifying testament to what humanity is capable of when it pushes the boundaries of possibility. Step 6. Tsar Bomba 100, the mother of all bombs. In the deepest chambers of the Soviet weapons program, hidden from the eyes of the world, a design was sketched that was meant to eclipse all that had come before it. A monster of a weapon that could shake the earth to its very core. Tsar Bomba 100, the mother of all bombs. Originally conceived for an unimaginable yield of 100 megatons of TNT, equivalent to 10,000 Hiroshima bombs. A plan so terrifying that it struck awe and fear into the engineers who developed it. They pictured the apocalyptic scenarios this weapon could unleash. A heat that turns cities to ash. Shock waves that would rock continents. And radiation that could poison life for generations to come. Tsar Bomba 100 is not just a bomb. It is a symbol of the dark side of human ingenuity. A reflection of the abysses into which we dare to gaze. Step 7. The Destructive Power. A Direct Comparison. Imagine standing at a point on Earth and witnessing simultaneously the destructive force of multiple atomic bombs detonating side by side. Hiroshima suddenly appears like a mere spark compared to the infernal fury of the Tsar Bomba. In this moment, we are taking you on an unparalleled journey through time and space to directly compare the immense forces dormant in these weapons. We place the fiery hell of Hiroshima next to North Korea's shockwave in 2017, the unstoppable B-83 against the awakening of the giant through Castle Bravo, and the queen of bombs beside her terrifying mother. We measure the inconceivable temperatures, the distances at which windows shatter and buildings collapse, and the radiation that could extinguish life on an entire continent. It is a direct comparison that collides not just numbers and facts, but also challenges our understanding of power and destruction. If you want to know now how to survive a nuclear strike and what to do after such a horrific attack, then click on this video now. We were absolutely shocked.